Hello. No, we are not going to talk about mathematics um, in this presentation. Why this title? You will understand pretty soon. I would like to start off by saying, for all of the viewers who prefer to not know, remember that not knowing is not equal to not having. So what exactly are we talking about? Basic questions that are applicable to all adults. What's your current weight and BMI or body mass index? What's your current waist circumference? Do you smoke? Do you exercise? And the following uh, within the last year. Your blood pressure, lipid profile, fasting but blood glucose and hemoglobin. Let's uh, get a sense uh, for the ideal numbers uh, for these uh, questions. Body mass index for uh, the Indian population less than 23 is considered ideal. Waist circumference women less than 80 centimeters and men less than 90 centimeters. Smoking obviously zero. Exercise 30 to 45 minutes every day blood pressure less than 120 by 80 lipid profile as you can see on your screen total cholesterol less than 200 milligrams per deciliter LDL cholesterol less than 100 HDL uh, cholesterol more than 40 triglycerides less than 150 for more information on this topic uh, you can um, uh, go uh, through the uh, cholesterol uh, presentation Fasting blood glucose uh, less than 100 is considered ideal. Hemoglobin, women, the range is between 12 to 15 grams per deciliter, men, 13 to 17 grams per deciliter. Why is it so important for us to know what the ideal numbers are? Firstly, you will be empowered, you understand your body well and if the numbers are way off you will now be able to take some corrective steps to get as close to this range as possible make changes to your lifestyle because uh, most of these uh, uh, important indicators that we've just talked about um, will improve considerably by making lifestyle modifications such as eating healthy staying active reducing your stress level, quitting smoking or chewing tobacco, quitting drinking if you are a regular or heavy drinker and uh, also you will um, know the importance of getting the right tests done. These are the basic basic uh, values that you need to be aware of. Many many health conditions that we um, are dealing with in this day and age have got a lot to do with these numbers being off, way off. Um, it's important to know these numbers also because uh, it will mean that you will be able to ask your doctor the right questions when you go for a consultation. Take action at the right time and avoid any unpleasant surprises in the future. Also you will be able to avoid costly procedures and hospitalizations by taking uh, the right steps at the right time. Most importantly, you will now be able to look forward to being a healthier person by making those significant changes to your lifestyle. For those with diabetes and or hypertension or high BP, I'd like to ask you uh, some specific questions. Did you get the following tests done within the last 6 to 12 months? Hemoglobin A1C, also known as A1C or glycated hemoglobin, fasting blood glucose, lipid profile, kidney function tests, and UMACR uh, urine test. Did you discuss uh, your uh, test results with your primary physician if you did get them done? 
did your doctor then tell you uh, how often you need to get these tests done these tests are extremely important uh, when someone has a diabetes uh, with or uh, without high bp because uh, we uh, know that these conditions are associated with uh, many complications including heart disease problems with circulation stroke um, etc by monitoring and keeping track of the degree or level of control uh, with these tests we can slow down and even prevent certain complications that can result from these conditions so it is extremely important that these tests are done on a regular basis and are kept track of basic lab tests once again fasting blood glucose and hemoglobin a1c uh, i've discussed this in more detail in pre diabetes and type 2 diabetes topics go, go ahead and uh, see them uh, for more information lipid profile you will find cholesterol topic hemoglobin i've discussed in anemia topic umacr and kidney function tests uh, you will get more information about these in diabetes and the kidneys topic Remember that an empowered you means a healthier you.